for our third season of Survivor Pandemic. Survivors moving away to one of the most hottest and one of the most brutal places in the world, the Sahara Desert, where 18 new group of survivors will embark on a Facebook online Zoom game for a cash prize of $200. And for the first time ever, the Survivor Pandemic franchise will release episodes. We're doing episodes? Oh my god. We'll outwit, outplay, and outlast all the rest to become the sole survivor. 39 days, 18 people, one survivor. Everybody, the Survivor Pandemic, the Sahara Desert. <laughs> All right, I love the enthusiasm right here. All right, so for the next 39 days, you guys will compete in an adventure of a lifetime. I want you guys to have a look at your fellow competition here. These 18 competitors can be your new best friends or your worst enemies. But the aspect of Survivor is to outwit, outplay, and outlast your competition. This is the Durag Beach. Uh, you guys are a tribe of 18 players. You guys will compete together as a tribe. You guys will win challenges as a tribe. And you guys will vote people out as a tribe. Now keep in mind that winning a, a, like, winning a Facebook work is nice, but if you believe that bragging rights for season three is not enough to inspire you, how about the grand prize winner wins $200? So, if money is nice, I hope that motivates you to actually try extra hard this season. <laughs> By the way, one thing I forgot to mention. So, our staple to the pandemic game is there will be chaos coins, where, which you could buy yourself idols and advantages in this game. Now, normally at the start of the game, we let you guys have one chaos coin to start. For this season, just like the desert, you start off with nothing. Everyone starts off with no coins. If you want to get yourself some idols or advantages, you got to build your way up and get as active as you can and build your coins up to get yourself powers in this game. Is there like a menu? There is a menu, which I will post in the tribe chat. Stand by for that. Okay. I want some serious coins. I love the coin advantage. Um, and the fact that they're called Chaos Coins with <laughs> from Chaos Cast, I love it. Oh my gosh. Um, I love it so much. Um, Chaos Cast is now Chaos Kristen. So let's get this game going because this is going to be a blast. Many people will judge me by my past, but guess what? I don't live in the past no more. I've made a couple mistakes, but guess what? That's going to change today. There is money on the line, green on the line, and guess what? I am here to stay and win this game, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm going to go off cam. Anthony and Darcy will go off cam, and then, uh, yeah, floor is yours. Good luck, guys. <laughs> What's so funny? What's so funny? Game is begun. Hi. Hello. I'm here. <laughs> I'm here. Hey guys. Hey guys. 
So we're gonna start since no one's starting. <laughs> My name is Jester21 from California. First impressions last, and first, first impressions should be good, right? I understand that I am a big name in the or community, so like I don't lie that I played few times already, three to four times or in org. So there you go. So Jester, have you won any of your orgs? No, that's the thing. <laughs> Well, hello, my name is Ariel. I'm 30 years old and I'm from San Antonio, Texas. Southern girl. You like the place I was in, cause girl, I've been first food, I've been last food, I've been everything in between. <laughs> so you have girl, one, Michael, so you have Michael, one before? I have one, yes, I've won um, two games okay. before. But I've never won a money game, so. Ariel, she definitely has to go. She's gotta be like number three. Her voice is annoying. She talks too much. I'm not down with that. Ty is coming off super hard or super like off. Like why you would ask the placement of any players that played before. That's not, I know it's a rookie mistake, but like that's not good. My name is John. I'm 32. Um, <laughs> Bowling Green, Kentucky. Uh, I've played in one other game that we don't call an org. Here's the tea. Jose played season two of the game that I originally played on. Kristen played in season five. Jose and I have been doing a thing called Mystical Creatures since the end of season two. And so we are very good friends, know each other very well. He's actually currently playing in season six. So I had to leave all the chats and people are freaking out right now. They're like, why are you leaving all the chats? And I'm like, I'm just gonna focus on this game. My reaction when I saw two people that I know, I was like, holy crap. <laughs> I, wa I wanted the opportunity to like play like with no previous connections and that just didn't happen but whatever it is part of the game all right i'll go i'm ty i uh, live in delaware on the east coast um i've never played in an org i didn't even know what the hell an org was oh my god um, welcome to the org community welcome to the community <laughs> You'll um, fit right in. I hope. Uh, I'm nervous as all get out. I'm afraid. Like I don't know what I got myself into. Um, I'm. Thir I'll be 37 in like a week. And you're, you're a liar. You're like 25. No, I swear to God, I'll be 37 in a in like a oh week. Oh my no, god, she's 18, girl. <laughs> right. It's the braces. Believe me, it's the braces. <laughs> now, how do you find out about these games? Um. So actually, um. So I went to high school with Anthony. Um, he, uh, he got me involved in one of the, uh, the survivor, uh, uh, Facebook groups, like, um, and I was really into it and he knows that I just love survivor. It's like one of my favorite shows that and amazing race, my favorites. And, um, and then he was about, actually he was about halfway through his season when he said, Hey, you got to watch this. You got to, you know, check it out, blah, blah, blah. And so basically that's how I got involved. Anthony um, and I went to high school together and he just kind of like pulled me in and now I'm in this crazy thing that I'm not really sure I fit into. <laughs> you will fit in, I love it. Jonathan Tovar, but I just go by Tovar. It's been a big time. I've, a funny story, back in grade school, there was like four Jonathan and it was already a JT, so that's why I was always going by Tovar. I lived in New York for years and um, I'm a bridal, registration specialist and that's my day job and fun fact is by my evenings when you know the bars are open i work as a drag queen <laughs> i've been a drag queen for four years now under the period based molly so that's a fun little fact yes so, girl. I, I love that right now i just gotta bat my little eyes and just you know, be sweet and you know i'm a southern belle i'm from the south so definitely know how to put on that sweet role Ooh. that's good i, I want to see so pictures of you in drag like please yeah, yeah. i think it's so freaking awesome that you like that you sew i swear to god i am not martha stewart i don't cook i, I don't sew i don't do any of that shit. you don't cook i learned in college so it's a skill that i'm happy i picked up so I definitely have to work my strategy this time because I'm used to working with girls, but there's a lot of strong men that I can see myself working with. And 
they didn't call me Tovarti in my whole season for no reason, so. So should I? Should I go? Is it my time to shine now? <laughs> so I guess I'll go. My name is Ryan Cunliffe. I am 21 years old. Oh my God, that sounds like old. I feel like I was 20 like yesterday. Anyways, I am- 37. Wait, wait. You're not 37, you're a liar. I'm 32. <laughs> I'm 32. You said 21 sounds old. You're a liar. You don't look 32. You look young. So that's a good thing. But I'm from Canada, actually. I'm from Hamilton, Ontario, which is like kind of near Toronto. Like, I usually just say I'm from Toronto to people on orgs. And they're like, oh, I know where that is. But I'm not from Toronto. Like, I'm like 45 minutes away from it. But yeah, I am a manager of a restaurant, like a KFC, I guess. So far, from what I saw, I see that we have a lot of, you know, different type of characters. I was keeping an eye on this guy, his name is Ryan. He is, he likes to call attention. He likes attention, you know, and I feel that he can rub people the wrong way. All right, I'll go next. Uh, name's Kurt, I'm 34, from Columbus, Georgia. Uh, never won an org, depending on the type of org. Like, placements are all kind of different, but in Survivor, I think the furthest I've gotten is like final six. What about a next top model? Yeah, that's the closest I've ever gotten to winning. This. That was second. <laughs> <laughs> can you, can, okay, so let me just start off by saying I'm the queen of bad internet. My, my internet sucks. So it's kind of touch and go. Like, I don't even know if y'all can hear me now. But anyway, my name is Belinda. I am 48 years old. No. I have six kids, two grandbabies. Oh, hell no. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I have been playing orgs two and a half years. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say it. So I have won seven games. Uh, I have come close a couple other times, but I've also been pre-merged. So, I mean, it's just, and I've played way too many games to even count. I don't know. Well, I guess I can do my next before, so I can put this monster up. Come see. Um, Amy, 45. Louisiana, uh, four kids, three grandkids. I am a nurse by day and wildlife re rehabilitation by night. Um, Love that. I have a, um, I'm usually big brother. I'm, I'm not survivor. I have won seven games. Um, I've only played a handful of survivor games though. I host sometimes, and I run a spoiler page. And that's about it. Belinda and Amy, they gotta go. They've been here, they've played games too many times, they've won too many times, and as a newbie, I can't have that. Uh, Santos, I'm 28 years old, and I'm from Miami, I'm from Miami, Florida. I actually have a Cuban background, I was born in Cuba. You know, I came to this country when I was 14, 14 years old. Currently, I'm working in an insurance company, you know, a medical insurance company. I don't really play a lot of these games, to be honest. I mean, um, when I first watched Survivor, I really liked it. I really like uh, Big Brother 2. Um, so I wanted to look forward to find a game similar to, you know, to, to watching the show. And I, that's how I found these games. But I don't play a lot of these games, you know. So I'm looking forward, you know, in playing with all of you and, you know, making a great game. I'm like a dog, you know. I'm cute to look at until you mess with me. And that's when I buy you. And there's some cute ass man. It's like that Santos guy. He can hit it any day of the week. Um, what to say that Santos is hot? Um, hi, so my name is Guillermo. Uh, I'm from California. Um, I'm a clinical social worker and I'm also a teacher. Um, so that's been keep, keeping me busy throughout this whole time. And this is my third org that I'm playing and I just got introduced through the org board, um, the orgs world over the summer. And so I guess sort of I'm still a newbie, but not a newbie at heart yet. Yeah, and then I, and I have a partner who I've been with for the last 11 years. Uh, we got engaged maybe about two years ago at a Gwen Stefani concert. Oh. So when's the wedding? Uh, no wedding yet. Oh. 
Is it just because of COVID or you just haven't started planning a wedding? Both. Oh, okay. So far the night's going well. Um, you know, a little cold. I need to snuggle with someone, but I don't know who yet. <laughs> um, you know, still getting to know the people and, you know, it's a really quiet oh. night and people are still getting to know each other, but just need to be on the lookout. So I have a question. I have a question. This is our tribe? Like... Yes, this is our tribe. Yep. This is I tribe. thought it was the, like the main people here, like everybody. Oh! Uh, yeah. It's Wait, one so there tribe. is a different group? It's, it's one tribe. That's what... That's what... So this is one world, basically? That, that's what it looks like. Oh, these no, are just like one tribe. No. I just took that in. It's one big tribe. tribe. There's probably a different tribe that we're going again. No, because I literally just watched the video and there was no other tribe name but the one tribe name. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Josh doing us dirty right now. Yeah, Josh yeah. knows their Like, what? <laughs> no, this is one <laughs> world. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Yeah. Josh, I'll fight you. I'll fight you. <laughs> He's so proud of us over there. All I gotta say is that you guys are the Durag tribe. That's all I gotta say. Fuck you, Josh. Ooh, what's everyone's zodiac sign? Oh god. Captain Scorpio. <gasps> Who said Scorpio? Toxic. Toxic. Oh my. <clears throat> I'm so sorry. I'm a nice one. <laughs> okay. I'm an Aries, so I'm sensitive. I'm an Aries. Are you? Aries. Yes, sister. We're Aries. <laughs> I'm a Libra. So this is my month. Oh my god, Libras. Libras are so toxic too. You don't like them? <laughs> no. <laughs> Why you had? A, you well, had I like you. Experience? I like you, but I don't. You like me? This. Okay, good. I've had bad experiences with Libras. Okay. Ryan's like calling out all these zodiac signs about. Um, I can't work with you, or I don't like that zodiac sign. I'm like, ooh. Um, I might like keep it down and just like tell yourself you don't like those zodiac signs i wouldn't be telling the people that are those zodiac signs that you don't like them i think josh is tripping us oh my gosh we're already at final five <laughs> yeah right <laughs> <laughs> no not final five there's final six bro <laughs> oh, <laughs> i'm here still just my camera's off so well no because there's two hosts so one two Oh yeah, there's. Yeah, don't even count Josh. So who's gonna make the alliance chat of us joke? So who's joking? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> like, do we feel good? Do we feel good in this group? You know, do we feel good? <laughs> yeah, I feel good. I'm surrounded by a bunch I love of boys. The, I love the six. I love the six. Let's kick it out. Like, <laughs> I do too. I don't know how we feel about this alliance so quick. You know, I feel that. I don't really know these players, but of course I'm down to it, you know? I'm down to it, but like I said, keeping an eye. But at this point, it's based on opportunity, so I'm gonna take what it, what, I'm gonna take what comes for me, you know? I'm gonna take it. So have you guys played together in previous, like, new games? Who? Like, a few of you, like, do you guys know anyone from, from previous games? Yeah, um, a few. Mm -hmm, I, think I so. don't know anyone, but I did. I do know Guillermo played another game that I was following for Turtle Island. I think. Oh yeah, I was following that as well. Get it ready. Like all the people I know that get ready. Yeah. So like the only people like like kind of know it's Cameron. So like I'm gonna do Cameron right away there. While uh, everybody was chit chatting away and getting to know each other, um, I was taking notes. I know Kurt. Kurt was my ride or die in uh, this last game I just played. Belinda, I, the bad thing about Belinda is her and I connect on so many different levels, but I did betray her like a year ago, so hopefully she don't hold grudges. Uh, then you got Ty, T-A-I, and uh, she's really new to orgs. I'm going to be as nice as I can to her, so then she can kind of be like my puppy dog and come back to me and start talking to me. Santos, he's a guy I want to get to know. He's from Miami, Cuba. He's newish, so same thing with uh, Ty. Then you got Tovar, which, you know, 
uh, drag queen is what he said. He's a Texas kid. But also, him, Ryan, and Jester are probably going to be really close. You know, they connect on that level that I can't connect with them on. I can't have them go into the end together. We're going to have to start taking some of these guys out. Ariel was talking to everybody. If you guys saw... What I saw from her is when she was on the call and you guys said, all right, now you guys can talk to people. She was on her phone the whole time. Oh, no, 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 no. That means, you know, right off the bat, she added me to a chat and she probably did to other people. You got to be low key like I did. Add somebody five minutes of talking. Add somebody five minutes of talking. But she was just too busy chit chatting away. She's too nice. She's too annoying. And I hope that annoying feature is going to get her out because she's won a couple of games, I think, is what she said. Final two. Let's do it. Let's do it. You host me. I play with I play with your game. Get your real honest opinion here, Jester. Let's talk some game here for a second, okay? Let's what do you go. Think of the alliance we were added to. Okay, since I know you, I pretty much know half the cast. <laughs> half the cast? Not like no, but like yeah, I see I'm, them I'm around. Like three people on this cast. So for sure, I know you. Wow. Um. Damn, you're popular. Not popular. Man, I mean, like Belinda, uh, Kurt, Belinda, Belinda, Ariel. Um, oh, and I know Ryan too. Ryan kind of, yeah. Yeah, he's sassy. Oh shit, he was, but I love, I like him so much. I see Chane, Chani, Kurt. I'm going around Germo for sure. What do you think I about the alliance that that Ariel? Put us oh, the alliance. We can use them. <laughs> we can use them. As, as I mean, as long as we have the majority, we can use them. Yeah, because you know, like, we got a thing here. You know, if there's only an 18 person cast, which that's what the intro said, that would mean that they're probably going to randomize to split us up. And I teams. don't. Yeah, they might. But the thing is, it causes tribe already. So this is my a one world, which is we're gonna go until like merge with yeah. no tribe swap. Mostly it's like an individual challenge all the time. I'm not sure. That could be. So, right. Someone will come tomorrow. Another 18 castaways. It's mm -hmm. right. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's well, like, this is like a sequestered on. thing. Get ready to go into battle. Mm -hmm. We are oh, going to battle, bro. Could be. Um, it's much, it's much yeah. it's much See, easier. Right now, it's just, you know, first impressions, you know, just from what I've gathered from this, you know. So. Yeah, that's why I stayed in the call because I don't want to get targeted. Like, I'm the first one who dope out in the freaking call. No, right. ain't happening. See? That's kind of where I was thinking of. I need to stay to the end just so, because you know, we build different conversations like this. Mm -hmm. Like, let's say I was the first one to leave, I wouldn't have this conversation with you right now. Yeah, same here, you know. So, where we are good, we're both gays. You can kill this shit out. No, I definitely feel that. I mean, like, mm -hmm. I'm not coming for you. For sure, I'm not calling you either. That's why. Yeah, I think like, that would be stupid. <laughs> like, like, yeah, I feel good with Santos too. Yes, I feel good with Santos too. Also, that's good. No, yeah, but just feel like I feel good about you, and like I like I want to work with you. So, I really do. I really do. I want yeah, I want Santos too. He he is fun, and the one did Dennis, Matt Dennis, whatever. John Christopher. Oh yeah. Yes, oh, yeah. I feel good about him too. And for sure, Cameron that just left. I guess I'm in the six-person alliance right now with someone I don't want to be, Ryan. Because he's just like a chihuahua. He's one of those gays, and I'm like, oh my god, just shut up. How do you feel about Ryan? Ryan can come live... I don't know, like 50-50, but like she's gay, so like we can use her. Yeah, but yeah, okay, I, I see. Why? Why? Okay, tell me, tell me, tell me. I mean, the like, I'm not trying to be a bitch, but I just think, like, it's like, hmm. He's just one of those gays who's just sassy, you know? And I'm like, you know, you and me are sassy, but he's just like. He is, he is sassy. I mean, he played this game, so. We. I kind of know him outside the game. He plays chaotic, if, 
if you need to know. So just let him do what he does and he'll... Mm -hmm. okay, and then if him. you throw his name out there and he found out it, he would go off. Like, No, I would never throw his name. I just don't know. Like, personality-wise, I'm like... He is... Yeah. Is he always like that? He is aggressive, yes. Okay. I just like was like... Yumi and Santos, that would be like the best possible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, he's a top and I'm bottom. I'm first. <laughs> I'm first, that's perfect. Hey. <laughs> that's Oh my god, I like this, this top. <laughs> Fuck. I'm gonna say to you, I'm I played with Guillermo before and he's good. He's good? He's, okay, yeah. He's a good I, ally. He's a... Uh, yeah, I can see he's like He's loyal. I will say about my past games, alliances I made or friendships I made from the very beginning, that's what I stick with all the way. Yeah, and I, I think stick. that's what hurts me, but you don't have to that's, worry about I it. I stick to like... I'm gonna just kind of lay low right now, especially because I feel like some of these people have played together. So some people, there are people who know each other already. So right now, I just have to be, you know, approachable, look very sweet, and then just, like, people approach me and hopefully, like, want to make deals and stuff. No, I'm excited to see what happens. No. Okay, yes. Okay. We're just, yeah, I mean, we're just, like, talking about our tree, our good tree here. Yeah, that we feel good right here. We do, of course, for With sure. us three. I think so. Mm-hmm, I'm down with you all. So like, uh, I feel like I feel really good with both of you. I don't know why, but it's like you know, it's first first impressions. Like you have a freaking bomb personality, and I love that. You know, you are down to earth, you are outspoken, you are fun. You know, those are the type of people that I like to associate with. So I feel that mm -hmm. us three, we can do some damage together. Like for sure. Yes, I like the damage. <laughs> <laughs> we can call it a damage, the damage alliance. The damage. Let's do some damage. You wanna <laughs> Oh my gosh, damn it, my identity came. Bring that bot back. You wanna make it one night now? I think I really would be okay with us three working it. Yes, Alliance. Like I mean Let's go, let's I, go. Work. Like I feel like I feel that it's fine, you know, to have a, a, a big group. You know, because that's gonna help us out. But at the at the end of the day, it's us yeah. three. You know, because yes, I, mean, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know these players. You might play with them from the past, but I feel that us three, if we stick together and we try to, you know, yeah. to, I feel we're gonna do good. You know, mm -hmm. I'm feeling really good about you know the aspect of this game. I have Jester, and I have. Tobar in an alliance that we made you know we got into a group chat out of the six people alliance which is Ariel, Ryan and Ken and we tried to make a three people alliance I came up with a name it's called the damage no I'm sorry it's called out the yeah let's do some damage <laughs> you're not gonna see it coming that's I much. feel like Right now, what we need to be doing is like, it's we know us three, it's us three. What we need to do yeah. is make sure that we make another person in that alliance feel comfortable. Yes. I right. can easily like, do that with Ariel, like, we're both in Texas, and then each of us pick one. And then we need to go outside the alliance and get numbers. Each of us control a group of people to make sure at the end of the day, it's going to be us three sitting pretty at the end. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love it. No, like, I like, no, like, literally, like, I talked about y'all, like, I like, I feel good. And then, yeah, I'll just start getting to know people and see what names are being thrown out. And then, like, you know, there's always that one person yeah, who let's just, just like, yeah, just like, keep it down low, like, it's, don't do sh something big, because we're big numbers yeah. right now. Mm -hmm. Follow with them. Yeah. And, then, like, and we oops. don't know what's going to happen. And then tomorrow. when merge comes, you're going to play. Yeah. Yeah. But also, we also need to be thinking about what the twist is going to be because there's a twist coming. For sure. Yeah. But like, yeah, right now that Ariel comes up, let's be loyal to that. Yeah, let's be loyal to the six. Yeah. But we, out I mean, of that six, it's good. Yeah. We're still. I mean, how many people are we uh, are here? Like in the in the game, it's like eighteen, 18. or sixteen. Eighteen. Eighteen. It's so, 18. for the first vote, 
we have we need, need 10 10 number 10 10 votes yes i mean i think we're gonna get it i think john john is cool too he seems cool too um what do you guys think about ty, ty? the lady ty she's, i mean she remember i'm being honest she's already reached out to me and she's asleep remember yeah. everybody now is gonna seem cool but we gotta choose who who do we think is gonna be better for us like mm. for our game she was very like aggressive asking questions like when she was asking like, how many games have you won like, yeah everything. like yeah was, like why would you would ask that? that like that's why like girl that's kind of off i mean i i yeah I, I said honesty but like don't ask my placement you know because yeah. i know that's just like what yeah i mean you don't that's, you don't what have that my heart. why would you need to know that like, like what i'm saying team. right now is like i do not you can uh, look at passy i do not betray my like people alliances that i make from the very beginning because that's the, the best team. like, like if you make alliance in the middle thing like but like y'all are the ones like i'm gonna ride or die like i'm not gonna ever mm -hmm. vote for unless it's to win but um, <laughs> yeah don't worry about that right? on for sure I swear on my drag career. <laughs> I will. <laughs> Let's talk.